I'm getting ready to change my muffler on my 11,000 watt power horse generator. I'm here at my food truck today. So here's my generator. I had it for almost two years now, but the muffler came loose and it broke a loose, I guess from the vibration and stuff. But I called power horse and they sent me a warranty replacement. But here's the muffler here. They send you a muffler kit. In reality, it's only four bolts you need to take a loose. I just took these off and left the bolts in there until I got my replacement. So I'm just showing you a look at the muffler. This is what happened to it. It just vibrated loose. I tack welded it, but you know how that is. You tack weld a few things, it's only going to last for a little while, especially on thin stuff like this on a muffler. All right, this is just the cover and stuff. The cover is good, but they send you all of that when you, um, so only thing you need is a 10 millimeter uh, socket. And just take these bolts out right here. And I also had one that was a uh, 13 millimeters, but for some reason, I, I don't know, they must have put a 13 millimeter in there. But on the replacement, they were all 10 millimeter screws. I'm just giving you a look of the muffler, what it looks like. See, it had a hole and it was getting loud and started burning a few things up, but this is the replacement. So first, what you wanna do is just put it in there and take these two screws and your seal right here Make sure you put that lock washer on there. These are the longer screws. So what you wanna do, as you can see, I already pushed my screws through there so I can align everything. Okay, and then what you want to do is just lift it up and line the holes together. And these two screws are the first screws you want to put on first. Just line it up and screw it. And if it's hard to screw in there, that means you cross threaded it. So make sure you don't cross thread it. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. So once you get these two screws on, you don't have to tighten it all the way up yet. And then come on the front and you're going to put those other two screws on. Like I say, it's only four screws. So I'm going to put these two on. And this come with the kit, plus they send you all the other screws also, which you don't need. As you see, I'm tightening it down. Then I'm gonna go on the other side and start tightening this up. And you want sure you got these all tight enough so it won't vibrate or loose again. So I'm just give it a last snug on it. Like I say, it's just those four screws, that's it. Right, I got it done. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start it up, make sure everything's okay. You can see it's on there really tight. And this power horse uh, generator, I've had it for going on two years now. I'll start it up. Start it up fine. So if this video helps, subscribe to my channel and you can look to the drop down on the top right if you need to purchase any of these parts. Also look in my description and visit my website at www.weldingandstuff.net. And thanks for watching. Have a great day.